want to share with you a word that the Lord gave me. The three wonders of the world. Many people speak about the seven wonders and they give too much importance to the seven wonders. But these three wonders that I will speak about them, they are more important and it will last forever because the fruit of these three wonders is everlasting life. The first wonder is to obey Jesus all the time and make the will of the Father. For that re reason, Jesus said, Not everyone says, Lord, Lord, will enter into the kingdom of God, but who makes the will of my Father? And narrow is the way that leads to life, and few find it. For that reason, it's really a wonder and a miracle to obey Jesus, because it's very difficult for a man to listen his voice in a world crowded and full of noises. You need a miracle and to be trained so you can distinguish his voice from other voices. It's very difficult because man always likes to live on his own. It's difficult to obey Jesus all the time. For that reason, many, they don't hear his voice because they don't want to obey. Even he speaks to you, you ignore his voice because you prefer to live on your own. Second, to live holiness is the second wonder. To live holiness is the big wonder in a wicked and adulterous generation that ask only signs. Jesus said, and when the people were gathered, thick together, he began to say, this is an evil generation. They seek a sign and there shall no sign be given it but the sign of Jonas, the prophet. So, to live holiness, it's very big wonder. 1 John chapter 5, verse 18, We know that whoever is born of God sins not, but he that is begotten of God keeps himself, and that wicked one touches him not. To keep yourself clean from, from this world, you must be born from God, my friend. And to be careful to keep your garments white without any spot, and to be, to be close of the throne of grace, to receive mercy and help in the time of need. It's a big miracle. It's not to see signs. You can see a sign, my friend. A miracle. And you can be happy and rejoice for that miracle and praise God. And after five minutes, you, re you return to the sin. You don't live holiness. So all these miracles didn't help you to live holiness. For that reason, you need to be filled by the Spirit, my friend. This is the wonder. To live holiness, you must be filled by the Spirit. And to have always to be close to Jesus, to the throne of grace, so you can ask mercy and receive help in the time of need. Number three, to resist Satan and his temptations is the third wonder. Satan, he won't stop to tempt you. He tempted Jesus and he dared, so he won't stop. You must cast out the doubts because the, this word people are in his hand and they obey Satan. So Satan can use anyone in your surrounding to make you fall 
and to bother you. It's a wonder, a miracle, to win against him and to be aware of his trap. If you are not close to Jesus, you won't have the warning. Holy Spirit says, watch out, be careful. Many times, before anything happens to me, before a big temptation, I got a warning from the Lord, from the Lord by the Holy Spirit. Sometimes one day before, sometimes three days before, sometimes before it happens, He says to me, watch out. There is warning. So this you need to resist Satan and the power of darkness all the time. So it's a wonder. So my friend, if you don't have these three wonders in your life, you can't please God. And you can't enter to the kingdom of God. So you need these miracles in your life. Don't search signs like the Pharisees. Don't search people they make signs. Search holiness, to live holiness and to make the will of the Father and to be holy in a wicked generation and to resist Satan and the sin and your old man so you can have always victory on them by Jesus. God bless you. For the Lord himself will descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of an archangel, and with the trumpet of God, and the dead in Christ will rise first. Then we who are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. Are you ready for the rapture?